This is I fall in love with Manufacturing Day. That's how organizers are describing this Valentine's Day at downtown Cleveland's Galleria. What you're going to see is a lot of people, and we're going to have manufacturers who will have a table, and they will be in a booth, like a little storefront, and they will be showing you what they do. It's the inaugural Cleveland International Manufacturing Conference and Expo, a big trade show celebrating and connecting the thousands of manufacturers here in Northeast Ohio. We believe that if we give people the chance to walk into the building with an idea or a desire, then they can walk out on the other side of the building in a couple of days with a new venture. The expo will run Tuesday and Wednesday with displays by more than a hundred top area manufacturers. Guest speakers, inventors, a workforce development center, even a resume drop will all be part of the show. This whole event is about growing your company. The event is timely. The Department of Labor says U.S. manufacturers added 50,000 jobs last month. And just last week, Ohio Governor John Kasich announced expansion and 200 new jobs at Euclid's Lincoln Electric. In manufacturing in America. And presidential candidate Newt Gingrich talked manufacturing jobs at metal parts maker Jurgens Incorporated in Cleveland's Collinwood area. Building uh, business partnerships with industry is what we're looking to do. The folks at Cleveland's NASA Glenn Research Center will also have a presence at the expo and are offering to share their technology and expertise. They recognize the importance of, uh, of our manufacturing base to build future jobs and, and help our economy. How can NASA and NASA Glenn be, be an important role in this? That's what we're looking at doing. NASA's even bringing an astronaut to sign autographs, but organizers say the manufacturing expo will be really down to earth. On your side in Cleveland, I'm Ted Cortan, News Channel 5.